Okay, so if you watched my last video, you saw that I had guinea pigs. So I'm going to do a little cage tour if you didn't get the last one, really. And I have to make a deal with you guys. Okay, so let's do the cage tour first. So over there, they have two different types of hay. They have local farm hay, which I buy in bulk for like, uh, like 200 cubic inches for $15. So imagine buying like two of the biggest bags of Care Fresh for fifteen dollars. That's how much hay I have. And it's all compressed like cubes. And I can break it apart into like strings how it is now. And they also have KT Timothy hay, natural Timothy hay. And I have a bag of KT Timothy Timothy hay like the kind with um marigold and carrot shreds and Mangoes in it. It's like the value pack. It's really small bags all in one. But I really don't give that to them. I give them to that them as like a treat. But so yeah, they really like their hay. And then over there, you can see is their bathroom. They really only use that corner, and they use this corner as a bathroom too. Then they have a food bowl. Please do not comment on below. How bad the food is, this and that. They don't need to have corn and seeds. Well, I got this food from someone. I didn't want them to starve overnight or for the next couple of days until I can get their new food. Might go to the pet store today. When I say today, it's, I think, 2 or 3 a.m. in Maryland. I didn't have school tomorrow, so I just stayed up and made this video. It's really late. I should be asleep. But yeah, I'm going either today, tomorrow, or I might go somewhere during the school week. So please do not comment, say anything bad about their food. If you do, I just want to block you. Because it's going to get on my nerves. I can tell now. They have a little chew block. But, wait, do not comment below about the food. That's as much as I'm going to exaggerate it. So back to the cage store. They have a chew block. The same chew block in blue over here. They use the blue one more. I don't know the, what's the difference. It might be a different flavor. Put in a little mirror right here. You might not be able to see it. Then they, over here they have Eagle Trishing Log. Then under here you can see one of the guinea pigs. And this is a little hidey house where I just took the towel into the side of the cage. And then he just sleeps on there. Sometimes he'll even sit right here. But, yep, there he goes right there, being adorable. They're really not that used to me. I only had them for a couple of hours. So, yeah. Like nudging the blanket. Calm down. And my other one, she's like always in this tunnel. You might not be able to see her. Yeah, you can't see her, but she never really comes out unless she's getting a drink or getting freaking water. I mean, getting a drink or getting freaking hay and food and some salad. Then she goes back in there. I'm like, why won't you play with the other one? It's really, it's really kind of crazy, but I get frustrated sometimes when I try and play with them. She stays in there. So, yeah, this is just their cage. The Super Pet, I think. Wait, I have to check. Super Pet. The Super Pet Habitat Defined. This cage cost $100. I got everything in the cage except for the hay, the water bottle, and the salad bowl and the salad for everything else that's in this cage. Except for the stuff I just need. Including the two guinea pigs. I got them for $30. That's like an automatic best deal ever. Because guinea pigs at Pet Store, Petco, PetSmart are overly priced. They're freaking $30 or $40 a piece. Like, who wants to pay that much? It's really annoying. But I might buy one from them. Just so they can have a little friend. So yeah, 
This is the cage is kind of big considering that they're still babies. Look, look how small they are. They're kind of still babies, so this cage is just fine. Please don't call me. I'll get a new cage. I'm getting a CSC cage for them. I'm sorry for all the sniffling, but my nose is stuffy. I'm getting this 2x4 CNC cage or 2x5, which fits in my room good. I'm getting. And then whatever leftover grids, I'm going to make tube and a hay rack. And I might make a playpen if I buy another pack. But no, I'm not going to buy another pack. Just going to buy that one pack. I'm getting mine from Bed Bath & Beyond. It comes with, I think, 19 in a pack. That's a lot of grids considering it's $20. But at freaking Walmart. I get a four cube set, which is like um, which is the same nineteen or no, it's actually fifteen. It's three cube set, and it's and one really long cube, well one rectangular cube, and it's freaking twenty five dollars. I'd rather go to Bed Bath & Beyond, spend $20 and get 19 cubes, and they're the perfect size. They're the 9x9 grids, so they're going to fit perfectly. I'm not going to get chloroplast. I'm going to just get, like, some, um, just newspaper and stuff. And I might, I saw this video on YouTube. I forgot who made it, but, I sh um, and she used a shower curtain. I'm going to do that. That's really smart. So yeah, I'm going to get that, make my cage, my guinea pig is going to be happy with their big cage, have a lot of boxes and toys to play with and treats. So yeah, and their owners, I don't think they ever gave them any vitamin C foods, except for strawberries and apples. And apples don't have vitamin C, so I hope they're not suffering, I think it's vitamin C deficiency. So yeah, tomorrow I'm going to buy a lot of kale and lots of... Lots of vegetables with vitamin C, bell peppers, especially bell peppers, and iceberg lettuce make them a really big salad, and hope they eat it. And if they don't eat it, I have to take them to the vet. And the owner, the old owners say they'll pay the first vet bill, but I will get them their checkups if they find anything wrong. The owners, old owners, said they're going to pay for it, so yeah. And... That's the guinea pig, so yeah. And the little task I want you guys to do for me. If you guys can get me up to 25 subscribers, 25 or 30 subscribers, I will hold a contest where I have to ship out gifts with real prizes. I will be giving away stuff like old tubes and stuff I don't use anymore. I might give away some bedding, give away some toys, give away some treats depending on... Um, which type of pet you have, but I won't be spending more than $25 on the gift, so it'll be like little like wear natural balls and stuff, like the little herb houses and the little tunnels. I might buy, if you have guinea pigs or um, a ferret or rabbit, if you win, you'll get a cuddle set. So I'll do another video later on today or tomorrow about prizes, so yeah. Just get me up to that many subscribers, and I'll have a contest. I don't. Um, the contest is most likely making me an intro because I don't have one. I really want one. So yeah, and I'm making a Facebook tonight or tomorrow for the contest, so you can get pictures and add me as a friend. So yeah, um, thank you, and please comment, rate, subscribe, and request videos. Please request some videos on my guinea pigs and. My hamsters, because I really need requests. So, thank you. Bye.